Long before telescopes and the laws of Kepler, the priests of Dendera charted a course through the heavens. The Egyptian priests inscribed their knowledge on a large circular relief, demonstrating their mastery of astrology and astronomy. Hidden from the world for centuries, the Dendera Zodiac demonstrates the ring of constellations, speaking of a time unending, a cycle of life, death, and rebirth. But how was it possible that without the technology of telescopes, the ancient Egyptians were able to create the only complete map that we have of an ancient sky? This ancient star map was discovered on the ceiling of the Dendera Temple just north of ancient Thebes, which is now Luxor. Since its discovery, there has been controversy around the zodiac's dating. Sylvie Cauville and Eric Aubert believe that this ancient artifact dates back to the year 50 BC. Their dating is based on its depictions of the five planets known to the Egyptians in a configuration that occurs once every thousand years and the identification of two eclipses. When the mathematician Joseph Fourier accompanied Napoleon to Egypt, he had originally dated this artifact back much further to around 2500 BC. The general consensus is that the solar eclipse indicates the date of the 7th of March, 51 BC. It is represented by a circle containing the goddess Isis holding a baboon by the tail. The lunar eclipse indicates the date of the 25th of September, 52 BC, and it is represented by the eye of Horus locked into a circle. When looking at the accuracy of the Dendera zodiac, there are several aspects which need to be considered. Let's break it down. The zodiac shows a relatively accurate representation of the night sky, as it would have appeared in ancient Egypt. The positions of the constellations and certain celestial bodies are depicted with a fair degree of accuracy for the time. This suggests that the ancient Egyptians had a sophisticated understanding of star positions and could map them with considerable precision, even without modern tools. The zodiac includes representations of planets known to the ancient Egyptians. The positions of these planets correspond to their actual astronomical positions in the year 50 BC, which demonstrates a level of precise knowledge for that moment in time. This level of detail indicates that the Egyptians not only observed the planets, but also understood their movements across the sky over time, aligning with specific historical dates. The zodiac also includes references to solar and lunar eclipses, these references demonstrate a knowledge of eclipse cycles and their prediction. The ability to predict eclipses implies an advanced understanding of lunar and solar cycles, which is a remarkable achievement in ancient astronomy.